Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Welcome back if you're already a subscriber. Um, if you're not already subscribed, I hope you will by the end of this video. I'm here today to, pl uh, to memory plan the week of March 23rd to 29th 2020 in my recollections planner from Michaels. I'm going to be using this kit by Wendy Prince called Spring Fling. I keep thinking it's called Hello Spring but it's actually called Spring Fling. Uh, I picked this up a few uh, weeks ago and I'm just going to walk through the kit. I don't think I had a chance to haul this. Um, I was I received it before I started filming again. So you get nine full boxes here with some quarter boxes, pattern quarter boxes at the top there. Then you get your uh, full box checklist, some Monday through Sunday boxes, uh, Monday through Sunday boxes, some other some appointment labels. You get your date covers, date dots, some deco, some icons, and a little weekend banner. You have some headers um, to do today and littles, and then some other sidebar headers, some little things, some more quarter boxes, freestanding bow checklists, flags. Uh, labels, more boxes, half boxes, things like that. And then you get your bottom washi. I'm going to put it this way. Yeah, bottom washi, some washi chunks. And these are all actually um, headers. So you have four sets of patterned headers, which is very nice indeed. So Wendy Prince, she um, has an amazing way of colour. Full saturation, really bright, really colourful. And pink and teal are like my favourite colours. So I'm um, really excited to bring this kit into this week. Um, March is looking kind of fun um, as I go through this. So um, yeah, I'll have a little fit through at the end for you to see all the different kits that I've used throughout March. Um, but if you want to see how I use this kit, then uh, stay tuned. So I'm going to start with the bottom washi. I'm super tempted to bring in another washi. Um, just to, it's a lot of floral, but then I've also got floral at the top as well, so it will be balanced. So yeah, so this week was the first week um, of isolation for me and my husband because my husband had symptoms. Um, and so we, I had to stay isolated for 14 days. He needed to stay isolated for seven days or until his symptoms got better. They did thankfully by the end of this week and you'll see that as we go through the day by day. But, um, yeah, so we were, couldn't, we couldn't go to the shops. We couldn't go to, um, anywhere. So my mum dropped off some groceries for us and that was that was so great of her using my so crafty knife that technically is my sister's that I stole but she got it from Aldi um so yeah oh no okay I'm just gonna leave it there The line in the recollection is like, oh, it's really, I'll fix that later. They're really weird. They're longer than the, the barrier thing. Anyway. So my mum had to get us groceries. Um, I am bringing in rose gold foil for this. Um, I wasn't sure which foil to bring. And then um, I found some half boxes and quarter boxes from Cozy Pedico that kind of work. And they're in rose gold. So I'm bringing in rose gold. So I've got these date dots from Morello Papery. Let's bring some bling. Although, yeah. I always have them all on this one. I'm going to have to use my new set. What do you do? I'm intrigued. Do you use the ones that you have or mix match ones? Or do you start a fresh sheet so that you can use those in a full week if you ever come across one? I'm intrigued. I don't know. I never know what to do for these. So yeah. I'm going to speed up through putting these down. I'm also going to put my um, headers down. And then we'll come back and we'll talk about full boxes.
go through the boxes now. There's a lot of padding going on. This is kind of exciting. So I'm in two minds whether to use the Hello Spring because spring technically started at the end of the last week. Um, however, the clocks did change this week. So technically summertime started. Um, so I'm in... Hmm, I think I want coffee and coffee Monday. That just kind of makes sense. And I actually started drinking a lot more coffee. Um, here. With the green background, so I'll pop it here. Balance it out. I think I will use Hello Spring. So there we have the basic spread. Let me stop moving it over. Okay, I'm gonna start building my sidebar. So the headers she has, the washi and headers. And the weekly boxes. Okay, so header down first. Moving into the day by day then. Um, first thing I wanted to mark on Monday. I'm gonna zoom in a bit. There we go. Woo! So the first thing that happened on Monday uh, was that homeschooling began. And I bought in these boxes here from Crazy Paper Co. I just thought the pink was perfect and then this is what inspired the rose gold. So I'm going to take one of these for this morning. Um, this is one from her One Dollar Wednesdays. I can't remember what colour it is. I do apologise. And I'm going to bring in some deco because the deco actually works perfectly with this kit. Well, obviously with the kit, but with this week, sorry. Um, so I'm going to take this backpack to denote 
homeschooling begins. Not that they needed a backpack because they're literally just in the lounge, but <laughs> there we go. And then I was going to bring in a today header. And use something from the kit to mark that I was baking so I don't know it, it seems to be the theme like we're all stuck in the house in lockdown and we just want to bake <laughs> like that just seems to be the um the essence of it really so I did bake I uh, went on to the BBC uh, CBBC website I think it was CBBS and went to the I can cook because I remember watching that when my um, eldest was little and she does really simple basic recipes that kids can absolutely delve into and um, so yeah so I found a recipe for these melting moments and they were like kind of like an enriched shortbread biscuit with like oats on and stuff they were really delicious um, and they're all like low calorie and kind of trying to reduce sugar and all that kind of stuff so I have this baking icon from the hummingbird planner and so I'm going to use that here and then I'm going to bling it up. I'm going to bling it up. I have these oh, these bows from Harriet Wright Designs and I'm just going to use this on the mixer and on the bag just to add me some foil. Lovely. Um, I do want to bring in a checklist and I'm umming and ahhing as to whether to bring in one of these from Notes and Clips or bring in the free signing checklist or, seeing as I have them, the full box checklists. See, I want three. So if I had, so I could only use six checklists on here because there are five heart checklists which could work maybe I don't need one for the weekend although I have written down something for everything or I can use these delicious ones let's see oh I'm kind of feeling it okay I'm going to use that and then what's great about these is they're cut out here and you can use the hearts then I might use the hearts to add some little foil accents as we go through. Um, so yeah, so my checklist. I did want to add an icon to that um, because I was doing some laundry. And I washed my sheets. So this is just from the kit. And then the last thing that I wanted to mark was that we had our announcement that lockdown was going to be a, a national thing. So I was, we were doing it because my husband um, had symptoms and then um, our Prime Minister announced that this was going to be a national thing. So I'm going to put your littles header down, it's not a little thing at all, but um, <laughs> this kind of worked. And then I want to bring in dark pink. Uh, why is it going to bring me in? That's weird. Hmm. I'm going to bring Yeah, so we had a big announcement. So I'm going to bring in another icon from the Hummingbird Planner. And this time it's the TV. And again, why am I going to add a heart? So we had the announcement that it was going to be um, a lockdown across the country. We're allowed out to work if we need to work away from home. We're allowed to have an hour's exercise and we're allowed to go food shopping and that is it. I did bring out these highlighters from Cozy Paper Co too. I just remembered to, um, I'm just going to pop this here as highlights of my week. 
I saw Mandy Dreams do this and I was like, oh my gosh, that's inspired. Because it's a highlighter. It's the highlight of your week. And I've just put it in the wrong place and it won't move. Okay, okay, okay. Put it to the end. There we go. So I wasn't sure which colour I would use. So, but the green one works beautifully there. Fab. Okay, so yeah, kind of a really crazy time, really crazy announcement. Lots of like, okay, so we're now in that situation. Okay, let's just, we'll deal with this. We'll deal with this. So, um, Tuesday, we did some work in the garden. Uh, while I YouTube binged. So, my kids, it was a beautiful day. I have to say, the weather this week was just stunning. And me and the kids worked outside. I want to pull in this really cute box here. This kind of third, but oh, it's green. Um, yeah, because I was going to bring in a foiled icon for this. So, oh, you save the green one for another day. Maybe use the hearts. Is there not one here? Okay. And then I have this school icon sheet from Harry Wright Designs. Um, and I was going to use a little pen pot. Uh, my son was doing some of his work in the garden. Um, and then I spent a lot of time just binging YouTube. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh no, my heart got stuck. One second. So I was just going to pop. my checklist there to remind me which who I binged watched and I've got this icon from Hello, uh, Harriet Wright Designs to uh, you can help me with that's what it was yeah it's all there <laughs> and then in the afternoon um well that, that night the kids had a bath and I played with my stickers so I'm going to use a quarter box from Cozy Paper Co to mark Beth Knight. And this is a heavy character design. So, and I've got a Beth icon again from Harry Art Designs. Just pop it in there. Oh, the foil is the same color. Huzzah! And then I'll do a to do header. Oh no, I'll do a today header. And then I've got to put the same with my stickers. I'm going to use a half box from the kit. I'm going to use this rose one. Oh no, that's the one there. I'll use the green one that I wanted to use before. Okay. Just fits. Oh, just fits. And I do want to use um, a piece of deco from the kit. So she has these rolls of washi, which I was playing with stickers, but it's okay. So maybe I'll put the a little one on top, like a washi stack. If I can get this. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, <laughs> there we have it. So, playing with my stickers, and it needs a bow on it. Let's pop a bow. Ah! On the top, on the top. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. That's so cute. Okay. Yeah. Okay, sorry. <laughs> so then Wednesday, I slept in. I didn't want to do anything. Um, I slept in. And then I had... Hmm. 
Oh, look at it. Oh, okay. Slept in, and we had more garden time. So, I'm going to use... I'm going to use... Oh. I'm going to use this box here. Sleeping in. And I have a pillow from Samantha May Sticks. To mark that. It's a bit big. Anyway. And then I will do a today header. And then use a half box to mark that we worked in the garden again. And to mark that, I'm going to use a piece of deco. She's got all these really pretty flowers. Yeah, I was going to use the rose. Can they put a bow in a rose? I think so. There we go. To mark they're working in the garden. Then I wanted to... We um, got Disney Plus this day, and so I didn't log on until this night, and then I watched High School Musical 1 and 2 and Camp Rock. And then I also had a Zoom call with my Swim World consultant. So, I'm going to do a checklist first, even though it's kind of out of order. And then I'm going to add a box at the bottom to mark that. Oh, oh, it's just that top part. So that's to watch all the movies I watched. <laughs> and then it was, let me do a little flower. That was for my Slimming World meeting, and I'm going to use a laptop sticker. Ah, I lost my little sticker book. Where'd it go? Ah, oh, there it is. So this is from the Pink Room Co. So I'm going to use a laptop sticker. Sorry for being so indecisive. Uh, I think I'm going to use another heart. So this being... There we go. Double heart in it. I did want to use an icon for marking watching Disney. But I can't find a Disney um, icon that would work. Um, and they're all very bright and colourful. And, so, and I was watching High School Musical. So I didn't really have anything. If I come across something, I will let you know and I will add it on. <laughs> okay, so moving on to the next part of the week then. Thursday. Thursday was a drama day. Thursday was a, was a drama day. So I'm going to take this green box here. Um, full on drama day and I've got this piece of deco here that I got from a sampler and I can't remember the name of the shop but this is beautiful um, so I'm going to mark that I stayed in my pyjamas all day the kids stayed in their pyjamas all day we didn't do any work we had, you know it was a teacher training day and training on to be Trying to be calm. So, <laughs> that was not working. We watched a lot of movies this day. Um, we not Disney Plus. We can't get Disney Plus on our TV. 
So we have to watch it through the laptop or our phones, which is kind of annoying. Our TV provider just hasn't updated yet, and it's just like, come on, I want to watch movies on my big TV. Um, we could, if we got an, I think if we got a, a fire stick, we could probably cast it, but yeah. Anyway, so we're watching it, watching some, uh, watching other movies. So we watched Goosebumps, Guardian Brothers. I watched The Pacifier in bed because I just love that movie. Um, so there is this little film strip icon on this sampler um, from Heart Art Design, so I'm just going to pull that in. Watch movies. Yeah. And then I had my team meeting on House Party. So I'm going to just go in and look at that. And I'm just going to use phone heart uh, where's it gone? it's pretty good so the phone icon from here I know we used I used my cell phone like my mobile phone <laughs> I just like the idea that it's I'm kind of an old fashioned phone it's fancy um, <laughs> excuse me um, so yeah, then we need a, I've lost my tennis shoes, where'd it go? Um, sorry about this. So, a today header. And then to mark the clapping for the NHS, I'm going to bring in a half box from the kit. I'm going to use this Lowe's one. Um, so this was an initiative brought out um, that on Thursday nights at 8pm we go outside and we clap for the NHS for, um, I think we did three minutes this time. And... It was the first time we'd seen our neighbours since lockdown. I mean, it wasn't that long, but... And then you could hear kind of things going off. There were fireworks. Um, because, I mean, our NHS are doing, and I'm sure every healthcare professional around the world is doing such an amazing job, and it was our way to recognise that. So, yeah, it was quite an emotional time. And my cousin and uh, her wife... They are, he, she's a paramedic and her, his, her wife is a nurse on a COVID ward and they, their neighbours were just so lovely. I wish we could have done something too, but they live too far away from us at the moment for us to travel. Um, um, at this point we were in lockdown anyway, we were in isolation anyway. So, uh, they, but they got champagne and they got a big massive round of applause and um, chocolate and cake and stuff. And their neighbours were just fantastic to them. So really grateful for that. So yeah, clap for the NHS, and that happens every Thursday too. Um, so next up is Friday, and on Friday, I made me some crumpets. <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. Um, well, I'm proud of myself, but they didn't work. Um, so I really fa fancied like crumpets or something for breakfast, and we didn't have any, so I decided to make some. So um, I found a recipe online, but it called for yeast, um, because you have to make a yeasted dough. And unfortunately, I think my yeast has died. Um, <laughs> so I'm pulling in this other, this baking uh, icon again from Hummingbird Panna. Um, to mark that I made crumpets. Um, they didn't quite rise. They were really dense, really doughy. But you know what? Nothing quite like something that you've baked yourself hot with butter on it, is there? Let's face it. So I enjoyed it thoroughly. <laughs> Um, I don't think my kids did, and um, I couldn't give it, um, my husband didn't want them any either, he was quite unwell at this, at this point, on this day, he was suffering quite badly, his um, chest was sore, he was still breathing, but he was also panicking a bit as well, and I was trying to stay calm, um, but yeah, it was just a bit of a stressful day, so he did, he's not, he wasn't been, he hadn't been eating, so he wasn't eating then either, um, so yeah, I then um, washed my hair, 
um, <laughs> for the first time in about a week. Um, and on that same sample that I got the dressing gown, there was this really cute... Um, ah, no. Okay, that's stuck there. That's stuck there. Um, this really cute um, shampoo and conditioner icon with a brush and a scrunchie. And that was me. So, there we go. Shampoo. Pop a little bow on there as well. So yeah, so I washed my hair. And then we had the Zoom call with my team. So we tried house party this day. And then this day we did Zoom. Monday we did, the following Monday we did um, teams. Back to Zoom, back to house party. And I think we house party for the rest of the week. And then this week we've been Zooming, so... So checklist there for that. We also, so this is my communication. So I zoomed with my team. I FaceTimed my, well, I say FaceTime, WhatsApp called, um, video called my mum and my sister actually came to the house. So she was kind of stood on the end of my drive and we stood at my door and we were just like waving at each other and like, you know, wanting to give each other a massive hug, but couldn't. And at this point it was okay. We were kind of like well aware of what the situation was, but the longer we've been in this isolation, the harder it has been not to just run and hug my family. Um, so yeah. And then... Oh yeah. And then in the evening we watched um, Detective Pikachu. So I'm going to bring in... This pink box here. For the littles. There we go. And we watched Detective Pikachu, which I think is using another TV icon as well. Yeah. Which now looks like the wrong colour. Hmm. Okay. Leave that for now. I'll use another heart. There we go. There we go. Cute. So, and then on Saturday, um, first thing I did was put on some new nails. So I'm using a third box, which I don't have because I used it down there. I should have used a blue box. Oh, I want to keep my pattern. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna take. The, I'm gonna swap this over, and I'll be right back. Okay. So I just swapped those round. Thankfully, no harm was caused in up to stickers in the making of this. Um. So yeah. So I um. I got some new nails. So I'm bringing in a new sticker. Uh, from Sweet Bean Plans. I'm thinking I'm going to probably have to do the light pink one. Because the dark pink is the colour of the box. So yeah, so I uh, stuck on a new set of nails because I started filming again this day. So I hadn't filmed since January maybe. And I thought now that we're in this lockdown situation, I've been binging YouTube like all week. I was like, okay. I'm going to start filming again. Um, that's not what I wanted to do. Can you pick this up? Please? Okay. That's not what I wanted to do because I have this flat lay from Paper Shire that I wanted to film, put in. And then I'm going to add a to do header. I filmed two videos this day, uploaded one, no, uploaded one on this day, which you'll see, I'll mark that, um, ah, come on, and then, yeah, I've just been trying to be on a roll, and <laughs> so far, I think I've put out a lot of content, and people are liking it, and I've getting more subscribers, and this is exciting, so we'll just see how this goes, but I'm definitely keen to keep this going and at this moment I have the time so 
yeah that's my plan so yeah did a lot of filming that was going to be my three heart checklist but then moving on we um mark uh, came downstairs we kind of we didn't sit together but um we kind of yeah enjoyed something together rather than him being stuck upstairs in his little isolation room um yeah my husband this whole week wasn't able to be in the lounge he could come down to get food but as he had symptoms and was suffering so I was doing a lot of deliveries up to his room and stuff but of course he had to stay upstairs but he came down this night and we sat and watched Saturday Night Takeaway together it was a best bits show and it was fantastic and we do love our um aunt and deck a lot in our household so we definitely enjoyed that together which was lovely the first thing we kind of enjoyed together ah that was what i was going to use the tv icon for <laughs> however yeah um so we ordered a chinese mark didn't eat much um i didn't want to cook again so we ordered Chinese. I'm going to use this knife and fork icon from the kit um, to mark. Do you make the icon straight or the heart straight? The icon straight. And then we watched um, Saturday Night Takeaway together. Um, so I want to use a bow. Yeah, we'll use a bow. And then we'll stick a bow on it. I'll make our bow, the knife and fork, and I'll half the bow. Stick a heart in it. Oh, that's cute. Okay, yeah. So we watched Saturday Night Takeaway together. Um, he still had to sleep in his um, room that night, um, but then he was, we'll get to Sunday. So <laughs> Sunday, it was spring forward, so I had to remember to change the clock on the mantelpiece. All of our other form phones, I'm like, our Google Home and everybody else just kind of automatically did it, which was amazing. So we just had to change the clock on the mantelpiece, which was fine. And so I have this um, UK holiday sheet from Diamond Prince Co. And she's got one that says clock go forward. So I'm going to be pulling this in. This is the, in the rose gold. See? And then what was I going to do? I have lots of things on here that I wanted to put in this. It was going to be half box first. So what I'm going to do... I'm going to use that for Zoom. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this in the bottom of the full box. Put it up there. I, don't, I think I want to do it up here because it happens in the morning. And this is on, like, the frosted paper. Um, like, the March and, like, the date covers from Morello Papery. And I just love it because there's no glare. Like, you just get foil. There's no glare, like, from clear stickers I love it anyway half box time there was too much to add to do a washi weekend banner I'd have to like too much stuff happened this week um <laughs> so that was to mark that we I zoomed uh with my church so I was going to use the coffee cup um I love how Carbo Couture uses uh, calls it coffee with Jesus and that's absolutely right <clears throat> Up until this week, um, I have a Tassimo, but up until this week I didn't really use it. And the only time I would ever have coffee was when I went, went to church. So, uh, she, I, like, you're speaking my language, Tiff. Like, totally get that. Um, and then I wanted to mark that I uploaded a video. Yeah, uploaded a video, um, which was kind of exciting. So, let's just... Follow the pattern. Do a to do header today header. And then the blocks. Any ones I've got left of this? Pencil. I do. Okay. Just Wednesday was a bit weird, but that's fine. Um <laughs> That was my upload and to, to mark that I want to use a Clever Girl Crafts heart. This is in the Sophie colourway and I just think it goes pretty darn well to be honest. The Sophie pink 
so you just can get a whole sheet of just the pink ones. So I uploaded a video there. You'll be seeing more of these cover girl crafts hearts as I mark the videos that are uploaded. And then in the afternoon we had our <laughs> our family um, World Cup draw. So if you've been following me on Instagram, um, and if you're not, you should go check me out at case 17 pounds um, You may have seen my spread where we did a virtual World Cup. Um, it was using spinners um, that my uncle was doing and we had his, uh, so my uncle married my aunt, so my aunt is my blood relative and his family we all love and we get together and we, can, we um, you know, hang out and stuff so uh, we all got together virtually and he did a Facebook live and he drew the teams for this day for our World Cup celebration. So our World Cup actually happened the next Thursday and well, if you stick around for my next uh, memory spread video then you'll find out more. And but essentially he did <laughs> he did the World Cup draw which was a hoot. I'm not going to lie. Um I'm not going to use No, I'm going to check this for this so it's like. So we did um a draw. I'm just wondering how to do this because we have checklists and then that but I don't need a checklist. Maybe a half box. I want to mark two things. The fact that Mark was now in general population. Huzzah. And then we did the World Cup World, the World Cup draw. So maybe Hmm. I was going to use this heart deco as Mark coming back. So maybe on this label here. So he was allowed to join us again. After his time away, which was lovely. And then in that space there, I can I fit? That's too skinny. Oh my. I'll think about it and come get back to you. Okay, so I decided to bring in this half box up here. The weekend's going to be slightly different anyway, that's fine. And that is to mark that we had this <laughs> Facebook Live. And I was looking and thinking about what to use. And I really want for um, a Facebook Live to draw teams for the, the Virtual World Cup. And I was just drawn to this recycled. Like... The idea of drawing things out of a hat, but I think what instead what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in um, that other laptop sticker. I think <laughs> that's probably for the best. So I have this one here. There's a lot of pink going on, but that's okay. So we'll uh, add a little heart onto there. So Facebook Live to draw our teams for the World Cup. Okay. And then we're done. Okay, let me zoom out and we'll kind of have a little look at the uh, overall spread. Okay, so here we go. Um, thank you for joining with us. I like the fact that I brought in those kind of pattern-free checkboxes. And there's a lot of pink going on. There's hints of green. But um, overall, I think quite a, quite a beautiful spread. Um... I'm going to fill it in because I know I'm not very good at doing that, but I'm going to do it off camera and then come back and show you. I think that's what I want to do. So, yeah. So, there you have it the filled in spread. I'll give you a little bit of a wiggle and a twerk. I think I prefer the wiggle to see all of the foil. There's no foil in my sidebar, which is a little bit apart from my march. Which, Oh, I suppose it's the headers. 
Very good. Um, really pleased how it came out. A lot of memories here, a lot of things that happened that were wouldn't normally get a mention, but um in this time, kind of giving it a giving it a mention and I really enjoyed I bring in this rose gold foil, I think it did work perfectly with it. I will be doing a quarter three, a quarter one flip through so you can see how my March turned out in my recollections planner, which I think you'll be intrigued by. Um, but anyway, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to, if you've got anything you want to comment on or add, please just drop it in the comments below. That would be great. Um, I'm trying to get better at this. And if you want to stick around to see what comes up next or watch any of my other videos, then please hit that subscribe button. And I will look forward to seeing you soon um, in the future. Bye.